see you, Kyle. Yeah, later, Kyle. I'll I'll let him know for sure, dude. All right. Oh, is this is this the new cool thing to do? Is you troll people by going Samus? Is this is this what all the cool kids are doing? Yeah. He's commentating now. Eglet, leave me alone. I. <laughs> <laughs> I hope I hope you win Apex chillin', am I right guys? Dude, Mike uh, you know, has been working on this as a legitimate counterpin to chillin', so I don't think this is him joking around. I think he's actually making a, a real strategic move here. So unlike West Balls. <laughs> what was West Balls doing? He you know, sometimes it's about more than just winning or being good at the game or Yeah, sometimes it's about flying across the world. Sometimes it's about getting, looking like a fucking idiot. And getting the loser finals fans and then throwing winning. away all your money and work. Sometimes it's just about doing a crazy Falco combo and just and like losing 3-0 because you're bad, you know? <laughs> I mean I don't know, he could just beat Leffen, right? Like Yeah. He's good enough. Yeah, he Why, What are you throwing is. away games for? I, I think, don't. you know, he already won. He already beat Leffen and Winners, right? So he's just like, oh, whatever. I have nothing left to prove. I can just That's stick around and try and disrespect you. You absolutely have things to prove. It's a double <laughs> elimination trick. Yeah, exactly. But, like, it's it's West Balls, you know? It's like, you just wouldn't understand that. Yeah, I, I really, <laughs> I really wouldn't. <laughs> yeah. But uh, I've noticed Mike Samus is going for all kinds of janky, weird aerials. And a lot of upbees. He's feeling the pressure, that sort of thing. So. Seems like he's trying to figure out some kind of like missile game control, but I don't really know that it exists. I think I think the Samuses that do well are the ones that know how, how often to mix in grabs, because like. Everybody acts like you can just shield everything Samus does, right? But the, but the smart Samai, they just come in and just raw grab you out of nowhere. That was interesting. I wonder if Nintendo's actually going for hard reads off of his upbees and chillin's approaches, because he just kind of hit one in the middle of nowhere there. But maybe he just got a little too antsy or something. Yeah, maybe. So one thing, one thing Nintendo could be going for is actually Super Missiles have enough shield stun that you can grab people during it. Oh, wow. If you do a missile, missile grab. So like he's he's putting he's putting Chillin in the bad situations, missling him. Chillin has to shield the missile, so it's, it's kind of a free grab. Right. So you can't really just like yeah. put that rock out of neutral, can you? I mean, you would have to get a pretty. Like, would you do it after you hit them, expecting them to shield or something? Like, really... uh, it's, yeah, it's when, it's when you have some kind of advantage. Like if they're if they're off stage and you know they're gonna barely land on stage and you don't have okay. enough time to like hard yeah, yeah. punish, you have enough time to missile. I don't know. All I know is that Locke does that to me like a million times every time we play, oh, wow. and it's really annoying. Is that like when you recover on stage, like with Marth or? Yeah, something? I feel like when Marth with Marth, and I try to like wave land on stage, and then obviously you have to shield because you're Marth, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah. And Marth okay. is terrible, and then you know, <laughs> I, I know how much shield. You yeah. Know. <laughs> Ooh, he should have should have nuch there. I forecasted a fat nuch. <laughs> I know that Nintendo plays with, or at least played with Locke a lot, so you, you should you should know about Samus stuff. He doesn't have an excuse to like not know Samus tech. I didn't realize they played a lot, but they both played Moko, right? So yeah, they're they're Moko. They're on the same uh, <laughs> they're in the same gym league gym. Yeah, that's right. Team. Yeah, I I really do miss uh, gym battles. Yeah, uh, yeah the, salt, <laughs> the salt was pretty cool. Yeah, I mean, that's kind of the case with a few things in this region, but that's fine. Actually, no, it's not, but whatever. <laughs> I think it's pretty immature, but it's a, I guess it's just going to happen. I mean, you just gotta roll with you know, it. It, the salt itself isn't a, isn't a desirable thing, but like it means that people care a lot, right? And that's something. Yeah. They're, uh, they're over emotionally invested, so you know. <laughs> <laughs> at the end of the day, you know, if, uh, if you're not treating it like it's real life, then are you really taking it seriously, you know? I mean, it is real life, right? <laughs> like, no, I'm serious. Like, I, I mean, you could say it's just a game, right? But it's not. Like, everybody here just plays melee it's all not. the time, every week. I'm serious. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I guess. 
I guess we just have different outlets now. Well, I guess it's different if it's like your career too. Or yeah, I mean it is for some people, but I mean even if it's just like, oh, this is how I'm choosing to spend my free time. Like if you, you know, if you spend like a couple hours every week practicing, and then no you, you have to get your on the stage. I don't know. Who cares? It's really weird. Yeah. <laughs> I see. Uh, I see Nintendo knows about down smash. It's pretty fast, pretty long. I've seen him whiff down smash a few times though. Yeah, whatever. Just get in like weird inside spacing. Just don't like, have it quite figured out. That's like, like a really cool example of how this game is like 3D. Because it came. The down smash like comes around and sends Fox the other way. I don't know. It's not like she's just kicking forward and then backwards. It's like she's kicking in a circle. It is kicking in a circle. Uh, thanks, Red. Sorry for not updating the game score. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you're, you're as bad as Bob. Yeah. Yeah, that was another another chance for that uh, missile missile grab trap. It seems like a good thing to do when you have this ability too. Yeah. The MDVA recovery, it's just straight up side view from the ledge. If it works, it works, right? Yeah, you can tell this is like a, a, a pocket character and not, you know, like a bona fide dual main or even a refined <laughs> secondary. You know? I, I, I believe according to Mike, it is a tertiary. Yeah, I mean, his secondary is probably what? Sheik or Peach? <laughs> I don't know. Oh wow. Push off strats are real. I think pretty sure Jillian was at 1% because of the camera. Like, wow, is that it? Oh, nice shot, Mike. Uh, <laughs> Savage. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess the secondary is Peach, right? Because he Peach shit as Peaches. I'm gonna do like a, a bit of meta commentary and say, you know, that that SD can really swing the uh, momentum of this match here. Oh uh, yeah. Just to provide some insight to our fans. Oh, uh, momentum and stuff. This match is really important because. Uh, yeah, you know, if if, <laughs> no, he, if, if he, Chillin' Dude wins, he'll be up 2-0. You know, like, and then he only has to win one more match, right? But if Nintendo Dude wins, then okay. it's one-one. All, it's all I'm trying to say is, you know, Nintendo Dude does not want to lose this. Going down 0-2. <laughs> This is never a place you want to put yourself in. Right? My favorite is there's some like scar commentary where he's like, where he's like, oh, is this a is this a best of three or a best of five? And then Toba's like, oh, it's a best of five. And then Scar's like, oh, well, then this match is super important. It's just like, what, what the fuck? There's only f like, yeah, dude. You know, I mean, first of all, it's it's strictly less important if it's a best of five than it's a best of three, right? Because like it's it's a smaller percentage of of a total win. And second of all, it's just like in a best of five, right? It's just like there's only five games are all oh. really important. You can't just like lose one of the games. You know what I mean? I don't know. I wonder if after you do the grapple with Samus, if you can just kind of fade back. It seems like Nintendo has gone on stage each time, and then he just gets up here. I honestly just don't know anything about Samus. So. Uh. But it seems like he'll do the snap up, and then he'll kind of jump up on stage really quick, and then chill and just snipes him with the. Or like I guess just like gets him with the up air every single time. Yeah, I don't know. I think I think there's like a a wall jump mix up. Wow. Where you like you, okay. you wall jump for some invincibility and then do an aerial. Yeah. And that, that would be like the up air or whatever. Some some Samus stuff. But I think you you basically just have that mix up where you either. Oh hey, uh, yeah, good good shit Tom. Good okay. shit. Yeah, I mean I know I know you personally hate Chillin' Dude, right? But you have to you have to give him his wins if he wants to match, yeah. Uh, yeah, you know me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm filled with hate for everyone I come across. <laughs> yeah. Chillin' chillin' and milkman are the people I hate the most. So. I, I guess that's uh that's the read. So. That's fine. Chillin' gave us some good viewers from what I understand. I just hate raids, so it's like Yeah, no such thing as bad publicity, right? Yeah, I guess. That's what they say. Uh, that was interesting. Uh, 
See, it's stuff like that. It's like, you know? <laughs> stuff yeah. like that that gives away the, the tertiary he, aspect. He probably, it's like, he probably could have popped the nuke instead. <laughs> oh, I mean, oh, that was the hell is slow. Samus just seems like the most unique character from, from like Ice Climbers or whatever. So it's like, you can tell the Samus means from the not Samus means pretty easily. I don't know. I think Yoshi is is pretty uh pretty different from the rest of the cast. Yeah, I was thinking maybe like Yoshi or Luigi or something. But I don't know. Samus is just like a bad peach, right? You just crash cancel things and hope your opponent sucks. It's whatever. <laughs> I suppose. Yeah, you shoot some super missiles. And, uh, if your opponent doesn't know what they're oh, doing, no, they just I, get hit by them. I, I really do miss Club Sheik, though. Because I felt like her uh, Club Samus rather. Nah. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I mean, whatever. We still have Duck, right? Basically the same thing. Nice. Time that was a good sequence. That, yeah, yeah. that looked like he knew how to guard. He's gotten chilling going for the stage a few times, so. Yeah. Good stuff. The double hit. <laughs> yeah. It always looks so nasty. Oh my god, that was gruesome. <laughs> oh, the crash cancel. Wow. Oh, he's got a save. Alright, good match. Nice. Finally busting out the niches. I, I just think like you wanna. Yeah, right. I think that, that like wave dash back down smash, I think he's used to like Icy's down smash where it comes up behind him first. Yeah. Or something. But but every time he does it, it's it's a good thing to do, but he doesn't turn around before he Yeah, yeah. Lets it rip. It's like he does weird wrong direction reverse. No, he probably or could just F smash. That would probably be why. I don't know frame data. I'm not a I'm not a frame data guy. Chillin' bust out the mark. Alright. Not chillin' Marth. So is chilling. Is Marth always been his strongest secondary tradition? Uh, I guess I know he was working on a Falco for a while. Oh yeah, he has a. Oh yeah, he did. Mario got Falco for a period. I don't know. I think I've seen his Marth more than his other secondaries. But yeah. Yeah. This is one of those matchups that everybody has claims is good for Marth and. Uh, I don't know. I don't see it. <laughs> I, I'm sure that means I'm just doing something really wrong, but... I think it's pretty darn strongly in Mars' favor, to be honest. Yeah, I mean, all the other Mars win it, so... Uh, I don't know. Yeah. It's like... You just keep Samus up forever, and you can fare through her missiles, and... You get a tipper, and then you win. It's like... <laughs> tipper fair to be... To be fair. That's a good edge guard. Chillin goes for a lot of those like weird side B to air stalls. Definitely not something I've explored very much. Testing options. Yeah, I think that was just one of those like sort of freestyle bears where it's like I'm falling and he's below me and I think I can hit him so I might as well dare kind of things. Well, like, he, he had time to set it up. Like, he was on the ground, and then he Definitely. jumped, and then he did it. Yeah. So I think I think he thinks it's a stomp, but, like, it's not a stomp. Yeah. The only player I've seen that would actually, like, implement real gears in tech chase attempts was Mewtwo Gang. And people don't really do it anymore. It seems to have fallen out of fashion, so I'm not it's, sure. It's not very good if they, yeah. like, crash cancel. Because if, if they just TI it properly, you can't really get a follow-up. No matter what. Falling up air, on the other hand, oh baby. See, like there, like people used to do it on platforms, but eventually, like people figured out you could just fall off the platform as oh, defense. Like there, you just fall off the platform. Yeah. Nobody cares. It's like good, good shit, Mark. <laughs> you hit me. Now what? Now what? Yeah. I think a general trend towards um, being less anti to throw out moves. That's a good thing for Marth. Yeah. I think, I think the perfect Marth never, never attacks, he just dash into the whole match. I'd yeah, agree. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> and, then, and then it times out. Yeah. Uh, 
I'll stick with that. <laughs> yeah, that, like that's not a thing, by the way. I throw, it, I throw a wave dash F smash. <laughs> it's not. You can't do that. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure that's not guaranteed on anyone. Samus <laughs> is so heavy. Oh, it's a. I mean, it's a thing on a Jiggly Club. Okay. I'll take it right for it, because you are the Puff Slayer. So. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Uh, it's not looking great right now. Also, oh, psych. <laughs> there you go. Alright, interesting. So Nintendo falls to Jones. He did not play Ices oh, once against Jones in Reasons. I don't know, did he play him as Ices in Winners or no? Uh, I don't that, know. Did that, did that happen in Winners? 